Welcome back to the channel, guys and girls. Today we're back at one of my favorite trout streams in all of Virginia, that being Big Tumbling Creek. As you can see, we're here at one of my absolute favorite holes. Absolutely gorgeous scenery we've got here today, guys. And this little hole is loaded with some beautiful rainbow trout. So I'm gonna go ahead and hop in here, guys, catch a few of these fish and have a good day. So go ahead and stick around. I've got a really awesome new prototype bait I'm gonna be trying, so we should have an absolute epic day. So let's get in here and let's get started. Yeah, there's something in there. There's one. Yeah, Black Creek bug. Dark little male, it looks like. Yeah, beautiful little guy. You gonna keep you some? You got a stringer? Put him on a stick, huh? Hey, you know I heard the question there ain't got something in there to protect the sand on the sandwich. It looks like it, don't it? Yeah. Uh, my, my cousin's husband is the one that comes up here and stocks. And he told my dad that uh, they're using all organic power. Nice. It is a beautiful fish, though. I mean, they do look better. They're all like that. They're all like that. Can't beat that, man. I'd say if I took its float off, I'd catch one first cast. Look at them coming. Like a rocket. Got him. Okay. Very first cast jigging. Had to have it. Woo! Another pretty one. They are beautiful colored. Very healthy stalker. That's what I like. Beautiful one. Here comes one. Get it. Oh. Oh, he had it. You little sap sucker, you. He's looking for it right there, see him? Yep. He's looking for it. Let's see if I can get in there to him fast enough. I don't know where he went. All right, there he is. Slid over there. Why not? There he is. Oh, he popped off that sucker. It'll happen on a job this size. There's another pretty one. Oh, I had one right there too, by golly. You see him come up out there, put him sideways. Yeah. They liked that fire bait, didn't they? They all freaked out when it came by. There he is. Another beautiful one. Wow, look at the colors on that one. That one bit my new little prototype lure. 
Dude. Can't show the camera that one. Not the mouth anymore. Can't show the old camera that one. Absolutely beautiful colored fish that daggum is it ever. No, they don't seem too skittish. Here comes their gear. They all come. Look at that. Come on, get it. Got it. <laughs> Telling you, man, daggum. Men RV baits are just killer. And these fish are beautiful up here out of Big Tumbling this morning. Look at them colors. Unbelievable. Oh my goodness, them colors are just ridiculous. <laughs> Absolutely gorgeous. Wow. The colors on that fish are just phenomenal. I'm going to slide down here on the other side of the fall. You want to join me? Looks like we wore them out on this side. That's all right. See anything from your angle? Me either. Wow, guys, look at how beautiful these runs are. Not a whole lot of fish in them today, but I mean, absolutely gorgeous. Got old fluff sitting up here on a on a steep rock, looking down at some. Don't see any. Gosh, guys, so beautiful. So stinking gorgeous up in here. Unbelievable. Well, we got four little eaters so far. Eight fillets. You had two pop off, so not too bad starting out. No, that's 10 fish right then. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? I'm, the way I met him was, he was up there fishing that hole above this on that next big hole. Yeah. And he had about a five pounder on his stranger and several small ones, you know. And I was like, dude, a mink just took your stranger under the rock. Oh, really? Yeah, and it uh, literally snuck up all, up to his feet pretty much. And it stole it. The whole chain. It took the whole chain. And you know, that thing was probably tickled to death with that. Yep. Look at that. I told you, there was probably one in here. Well, you was right. There's one in here. Oh, he's there's, fighting. There's my buddy. He's fighting hard, too. Look at that. I told you. Uh -oh, let me get out of here. He's fighting real hard. Here you go. I'll take it. Look. There's at least one in here. I just missed one. Pretty uh, little fish right there. Really, this, this stretch right here should be our savior. No kidding. It's feeling like it. Cannot believe that fish was hiding right there. That was so stupid shallow. See if we can get her up here to the old net. There we go. Beautiful fish right there. Wow, guys, look at that one. Heck yeah. I'd almost bet you a dollar there's going to be another one in there. That's hard to believe. It'd be a little old bitty fish like that hanging in such such nothing for water. Unbelievable. That's why you gotta that's why you gotta appreciate big tumble and it really changes it really changes the way one fishes. It's just so different. Well guys, we have fished our way to the very last spot of this creek. As you can see, just on the other side of the bridge there is a no trespassing sign, so we got private property just ahead of us. This is the very last bit of public on this creek. We fished our butts off today, guys. The creek just didn't have a whole lot to offer. Unfortunately, 
when you get stockings, guys, sometimes they're just kind of light, especially during the winter months when it's nice and cold like it has been here lately. But all in all, guys, super great day out here doing some fishing. Tried out those new prototypes, caught several on them. Went on ahead and put those up, picked up the old creek bug, finished up our limit for the day and had an absolute blast doing it. Got to fish with old fluff from Pots of the Outdoors. We fish together a couple times and every time we get together, it's just a good time. But if you enjoyed this video, guys, make sure you smash that like button. But leave me a comment down below. Any comment really does help out the channel. And again, if you can, boys and girls, do yourself some fishing and have some fun. But most importantly, be safe and tight lines.